So what is up pimps, hoes and buffaloes and welcome to my favourite class setup with the LMGs in Call of Duty Black Ops 2 and for some reason, when I was recording all of the other episodes, I managed to somehow miss out the LMGs. Don't ask why, I don't really know, it's not because they are terribly underpowered or not competitive with all the other weapon categories, I could not be further from the truth if I did say that. The LMGs are actually really strong in Black Ops 2 and what we've gone with today is the QBB LSW with a reflex sight and an adjustable stock. Of course I have the reflex sight on pretty much all of my weapons apart from the sniper rifle simply because I do find it very useful for that extra bit of precision at this point during the game when I'm getting to learn the lines of sight. And the adjustable stock means you can move faster when aiming down the sight. And of course, with a low mobile weapon like the LMGs and the LSW, you need to be able to move a lot quicker when you're aiming down the sight. And with the adjustable stock, it enables this to happen. Moving on to my secondary gun, we have the TAC-45 with an extended clip. You guys know that it's always going to be between the B23R and the TAC-45 for my secondary. I've just decided to go with the TAC-45 with the extended clip for this class. Moving on to my perk low. Out, we have the flak jacket, which of course means less explosive damage taken, toughness, which means you flinch less when you're shot, and tack mask, which reduces the effects of flashbangs, concussions, and shock charges, which is really good once again when you're using a low mobile weapon such as the LMG. And I don't have tack mask on any other class setup simply because I do seem to be a lot more mobile with the submachine guns, the assault rifles, and the shotguns, which means tack mask isn't really as useful as it is with an LMG when you want to get away from flashbangs and concussions much quicker. And of course, you can do that when the effects of them are not. As strong as they would normally be and of course we're going with the bouncing betty and of course the shock charge once again i've said and of course way too many times in this video but if you did enjoy this and you want to use this lmg class setup please do not hesitate to leave your video as a video response to this video if you've gone away and used the class that i've suggested for you right here check out all of the other ones i apologize once again to the lmgs for missing you out thank you for watching and i'll speak to you soon i'm out peace so then guys, if you did enjoy this video, please do not hesitate to leave it a like rating. It really does let me know how my videos are being perceived by you guys, my audience. And as well as that, on the screen right now is my previous video and also a random video. Both videos will open in separate tabs. Thank you for watching once again, and I'll speak to you shortly. Peace.